Indiana politicians about the health care bill. Now it looks like Anthem is weighing in on that. Jane King is live at the NASDAQ with those stories and so much more. Good morning. Hi, Scott Lauren. Good morning. Yes, Indianapolis-based Anthem endorsed the Senate health care legislation, citing the positive impact it would have on the individual market and premium costs. Now it says it will improve the stability of the individual market and moderate those premium increases, which have been rather large over the past few years. Now the Senate's bill has been criticized over its proposal to slow the expansion of Medicaid. Anthem indicated that was an issue it would be willing to work with the administration on. And President Trump got a victory at the Supreme Court for his proposed travel ban, but many Americans feel the new policies are still making travel more difficult. A study by HelpShip says the proposed laptop ban and confusion about visitors from Muslim countries, leaving 74% of Americans to say travel still is a hassle. Okay, a Purdue alum has won the world's top prize in food and agriculture, Iodeje Adesina, president of the African Development Bank Group, has been named the 2017 World Food Prize Laureate for his work as a reformer and leader of the agriculture sector in Africa. And this is the top prize for those who've improved the quality, quantity, and availability of food in the world. And Apple working with Hertz on self-driving cars. The tech giant will lease six cars from Hertz for testing, and Hertz shares just went wild on that news of 14%. The cars are Lexus SUVs. And then Alphabet and Avis reached a similar agreement. It was announced about the same time as that Hertz Apple deal. In the Avis agreement, it will help maintain Alphabet's self-driving car fleet in Phoenix, which began serving members of the public in April. And stocks closed mixed yesterday. The Dow did stop a four-session losing streak. Tech stocks fell. Banks led the way higher. The Dow rose about 15 points. We're looking lower for the start of things today. We will be watching Google, the EU, uh, European Union today, slapping a big fine on Google for what they say, too much dominance in search in Europe. So we'll see how Google reacts to that today. Live from the NASDAQ market site in Times Square, I'm Jane King. Back to you, Scott Lauren. Okay, Jane, we know that Amazon has played around with drone delivery. Now Oscar Mayer is doing it too? Uh, they are. Uh, imagine uh, just hanging out and a hot dog just falls in your lap. Because Sounds like Oscar heaven. Mayer pushing, yeah, no kidding, is pushing new hot dogs just in time for the 4th of July. Uh, the company has hired a drone to drop its new nitrate and preservative-free dogs on Wiener, Arkansas on this <laughs> holiday. Only in Wiener, Arkansas is this happening. No word on if ketchup and relish are included oh, in this. What about chili? Everything is happening in Wiener, Arkansas. Maybe chili. They could drop some chili, too. That'd be there I like you go. I didn't know there was a Wiener, Arkansas. No. That's see, James there is such a place. I actually Googled it. Yeah. And this is <laughs> I wanted why to make you sure it actually favorite. existed. Exactly. Yep. Oh boy. Thank you. Watch